Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. Code Academy bug report. <clears throat> this is return functions in JavaScript 3 of 5. <laughs> uh, in order to learn how to use the for loop, you have to look at the following exercise right there. The following, for more on the for loop, please refer to the following exercise, which, uh, yeah, okay, <clears throat> that's. I would say that's probably bad design. Uh, complicated more by not being able to tell specifically why I'm going to rate this exercise with a red thumb. There should be some place in here for me to import, or rather input, uh, feedback, specifically in light of these kinds of oversights in the design. Maybe it's not an oversight, but it certainly doesn't make it uh, more self-evident when the most difficult part of the for loop is knowing what to put in the parentheses after the for loop, which is what we are looking at, but we haven't learned that because it is in the following exercise, which we don't have access to because the UI doesn't allow you to go to the next exercise until you've successfully completed this one. So, uh, I'd like to bring that to the attention of the designer. I believe his name is Amjad. Please fix this when you get a chance. Thank you, and happy computing.